Hey everyone, David here at Valley and Beyond and almost the end of 2018. And, uh, you know, um, some of you may know we, we've kind of started doing some live video and, and uh, doing a kind of a message uh, on video uh, really only maybe a couple of months ago. And, and uh, we've had a lot of live and lot, we have guests and we're talking about a lot of different things. and. And, the, and we're having meditation evenings here at the store in this meditation room and we're going to develop another meditation room and we're going to do a whole bunch of stuff. We've got to, we're going to open up a Patreon site because uh, really what we've discovered is that we're on a mission. And, and uh, you know, the mission for me began uh, with lifting the vibration of the planet one meditator at a time, making meditation easy and inviting for everyone. And, and, uh, and then what's happened is that... Um, you know, the idea of consciousness uh, has been coming through in the talks and, and I've been reading from, from different authors' books and, and uh, the idea of, of, uh, uh, of uh, what does consciousness mean and in, in, uh, what, are, what are we conscious of? And, and, uh, um, and it's, it's really come up that most of us don't have a language. We don't have a language for feelings, emotions, we don't have a language for what's happening in our mind. Um, you know, the complaint people are sharing with me around meditation is, you know, I can't make my mind stop, you know, and, uh, you know, thoughts seem to be tied to emotions. And, and uh, it's, a, it's a, for the most part, how many of us have learned to deal with what's going on inside of us you know, where we need to be conscious of what's going on inside of us is through uh, diversion, you know, whether it's, uh, you know, drugs, alcohol, food, sex, work, gambling, things, uh, you know, that interests that take us out of the moment because when we're present, then uh, we're present to what's happening. And, and what's happening in our emotions, what's happening in our in our bodies, what's happening in our mind, and uh, but we don't seem to have a language for that. So um, I I don't really see myself as a qualified teacher in that area, and, and uh, um, I have some experience. I think I, you know, almost forty years of exploring you know spirituality and consciousness and awareness and 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 uh, doing personal development and and uh, um, and for the most part. Um, it's been a, you know, exploratory thing. You know, I, I've been, there's no, there's no real place you can go and kind of get all the information, or there didn't seem to be, uh, until I discovered uh, Dr. David Hawkins. And, and uh, Hawkins has done a number of books. His first book was Power Versus Force, which would have been, I think, in the 90s. And it, it was amazing. It's a bestseller. And, and uh, he did a number of books since then. And then his last book, was this one called Letting Go. And, uh, and everything that you could possibly want to know about consciousness and, and about the human uh, being is, is in this book. It's amazing. And uh, so starting uh, in the new year, I'm going to read it to you. <clears throat> so I'm going to see, you know, if you like that idea, uh, if you're interested in consciousness, if you're interested in... Uh, in, in, you know, being aware of, uh, you know, not just aware of where you're going or what you're trying to get or what, what you have or left behind or what you might lose or all of those things that are outside of you, but being aware of what's going on on the inside, um, I think you're going to benefit. We're all going to benefit from this. And, and uh, um, you know, uh, just in the prefaces, there's such a great, you know, it's, it's a great book. So I suggest you go out and get it. Uh, we, we hopefully will have a link in the next day or two so you can order it through us if you want. Um, but, um, you know, you can, I think you can probably go to the bookstore, you can go to Chapters or uh, somewhere like that and, and pick a copy of this book up. It's his last book. Uh, you can order it on Amazon. And even if you, you get a, uh, you know, a few days behind, uh, don't worry about it. Uh, I'm only going to read maybe 15 or 20 minutes a day and maybe we'll discuss it a little bit. And, um, and I'm open to discussion of, of what we're reading. And, you know, chapter one, I'm just looking at the, the you know, introduction. Uh, uh, while in contemplation one day, the mind said, what in the world is wrong with us? Why doesn't happiness stay put? 
Where are the answers? How do we address the human dilemma? Have I gone nuts or has the world gone crazy? The solution to any problem seems to bring only brief relief, for it is the very basis of the next problem. Is the human mind a hopeless squirrel cage? Is everybody confused? Does God know what he's doing? Is God dead? The mind just kept chattering along. Does anybody have the secret? <laughs> Don't worry, everybody's desperate. Some s seem cool about it. I can't see wh what all the fuss is about, they say. Life seems simple to me. They are so scared they can't even look at it. Anyway, uh, how about the experts? Their confusion is more sophisticated, wrapped in impressive jargon and elaborate mental construction. They have uh, predetermined belief systems into which they try to squeeze you. Seems to work for a while, and then it's just back to the one's original state again. So it, there's the beginning of the question. You know, what's going on here? And, and uh, I think it's a great book. It's been a life changer for me and uh, the people that I know that have read it. And, and it's a very high vibration book. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to read this book. Uh, and uh, um, I, don't I, I don't know of a better way to support my community uh, than, than doing this. And, and uh, Hawkins is amazing. And he's not selling any belief system. There's no um, faith. It's not faith-based. It's, it's, uh, it's really uh, nails down what's happening in here. And, uh, um, and it, I think, moves us, you know, very in, into the 21st century of what's available in, uh, in, in you know, uh, around the understanding of, of how we work in our feelings and our emotions and in our minds. And so that's, I'm excited about that. I really am. It just, you know, well, Earl and I talked about it a week or two ago and, and uh, and I thought, geez, I don't know, how can I do that, you know, and, and uh, what book would I read? He earlier suggested uh, maybe Eckhart Tolle, but, um, maybe we'll do Eckhart next. But this is the, the deal, and, and uh, uh, let me know what you think of this, if it's, uh, you know, a, a good idea or not. We're going to do it, I think we're going to do it live, and then m maybe we'll send it in our email on our daily basis. I, I don't know, but I think we'll do it live. It'll be on Facebook and on YouTube. Um, we'd love it if you go onto our YouTube channel and subscribe. Yeah, um, you know, I'll just keep asking. And we're going to do a Patreon uh, um, uh, thing. What is it? We're, you know, uh, we're going to have a, like a, um, a channel on Patreon. And, and I'll explain what that's about, too. And, and uh, so we have a mission. And I see it as a mission. You know, I've been doing this business, uh, the Bali and Beyond business, for nine years. And, and the truth is we've never made any money. I'm probably out about a half a million dollars. And... and uh, uh, but we've helped a lot of people, and uh, uh, you know we've we've made a big difference. I think in Indonesia, and, and people love our stuff, and, and uh, hopefully we've helped people create sacred spaces, and you know help change some lives, and and now it's really evolved into this space where people come in the day, and we sit and talk, and I'm available to do that, and you know and and, and come in and get hugs and love, and and uh, and you know just tell us what's going on in your lives, and and. Uh, that's what we're doing here. We're going to make a bigger space in the back for setting up a meditation and I events and dance and, and, and stuff like that and have maybe have speakers and guests come from time to time. So that's it. I <laughs> love you guys. It's taking a new direction. We're going to read a book. Uh, tell me what you think of that. And uh, I won't say too much Happy New Year yet because we're not quite there, but uh, we'll talk again before we get there. Pop in and see us. Uh, you know, we're still, we still do have a business and we've got lots of things here, you know, meditation spaces we want to help you create. Because I think meditation helps us to get more centered so we can be aware uh, of what's happening, of what we're feeling, you know. And, and when it, as we go through this book, we'll be able to learn a language of how to label it. And, and uh, um, Dr. David Hawkins, Letting Go, coming at you. Love you guys. Cheers.